so today we are going to discuss about how to identify real or make-believe and fact or non-fact images. So come on, let's start! Wow. At this time, let's start with a game. So are you ready? Let's begin now! So you will just identify each of the following images if it is believable or unbelievable. For every correct answer, a star will be given to you by your teacher. So just write it on a piece of paper. Airplane. Is it believable or unbelievable? Identified flying object or UFO. Is it believable or unbelievable? A pilot. Is it believable or unbelievable? Wow. Alien. Is it believable? Or unbelievable. A horse. Is it believable or unbelievable? And unicorn. Is it believable or unbelievable? So now it's time to reveal the answers. Let's begin with an airplane. Airplane is a powered fixed-wing aircraft that is propelled forward by thrust from a jet engine, propeller, or rocket engine. It is also capable of transporting parcels as well as people to the other side of the world in less than a day. So therefore, it is believable. Next is alien spacecraft or unidentified flying object or UFO. According to some studies, ufology is not generally considered credible in mainstream science. Scientific investigation into UFO sightings is warranted, with the general conclusion that the phenomenon was not worthy of serious investigation except as a cultural artifact. So with this, it is lack of complete information. Therefore, it is unbelievable. The third image is the pilot. A pilot is a person aboard the aircraft who is ultimately responsible for its operation and safety during flight. So therefore, it is believable. Next is an alien. They said that it is a life which does not originate from Earth. And according to Josh Calcino, the University of Queensland and J. Clark University of Southern Queensland, they don't have the perfect technology to study such faraway places, but they are still trying. So with this statement, we can say that it is unbelievable. A horse. It is a large plant eating domesticated mama with solid hoofs and a flowing mane and tail, used for riding, racing, and to carry and pull loads. So, with that, it is believable. And the last one is unicorn. Unicorn is a mythical animal typically represented as a horse with a single straight horn projecting from its forehead. Therefore, it is unbelievable. Now, how many stars were you able to have? 
But before you answer that, let us see if we have the same reasons for those unbelievable and believable images. Now let's begin with the believable images, such as an airplane, a horse, and a pilot. We believe because they exist. And if they exist, it means that they are real. And if they are real, they are supported with the facts. For our unbelievable images, such as UFO, unicorn, and alien, we don't believe because they do not really exist. And if they do not exist, they are just make-believe because they are not supported with facts. Remember, when we say real, it is the action of being true, being exactly as appears or as claimed, and not merely seeming pretended, imagined, and fictitious. And when we say fact, it is a piece of information used as evidence or as part of a report or news article. It is also something that has occurred or has been proven correct. So therefore, real and fact are best friends. Now what about make-believe? In the definition of make-believe, it means believing or imagining things that appear to be attractive or exciting but are not real. It means it isn't real or lacking in reality or substance. And when we say non-fact, a thing that is not true or provable, that which is not a fact or just an opinion or falsehood. In this case, make-believe and non-fact are also best friends. Wow! Now here are some examples that will help you understand more about the topic. On our first example, we have an image of Nardong Putik of Cavite. Nardong Putik was famous for believing that anting anting or amulets protected him against ambushes, gunfights, and arrests. He even tattooed the magical medallion on his body along with Masonic protection charms and the word Kilabot across his torso. Unfortunately, still there is no evidence or fact that will prove that this is real. So we can say that this is just a make-believe or non-fact. On our second image, according to the news, the NBI agents immediately jump in Nardong Putik's vehicle and take cover. Some agents were still firing him guns to make sure that he is dead. Nardo learned his lesson that his amulet has no match in the guns of the NBI agents. On his death, some of his men were charged in the court for murder. So with this kind of statement, it is real because it is based on the fact. For our next example, we have an image of a tree giant. Some believed that our President Emilio Aguinaldo had a tree giant friend. But still, until now, there's no evidence or fact about it. So, we can consider this as make-believe or non-fact. Next is an image of Emilio Aguinaldo. 
according to our history, Emilio Aguinaldo is officially recognized as the first president of the Philippines who lived in Kawit Cavite. So it means that this is real because it is supported with fact. Now may I just remind you that images are sometimes deceiving. This make you believe something that is not true. Most especially now in social networking sites that provide users with capabilities to spread information quickly to other users without confirmation of its truth. We tend to believe and assume it is true unless we know for certain that it is not. The best example of this is an image of so-called Kikyam Silog in which according to the uploader, this food was served to the athletes of SEA Games held in the Philippines last year. It became viral in social media even without details of facts if it is true or not. It was only cleared when the management of Whitewoods Hotel posted their official statement on the SEA Games issues and this is what they said. We serve athletes a buffet that is part of a meal plan prepared by the organizers. For the specific breakfast meal in question, chicken sausage and not kikyam was part of a wider menu that included an omelet station, other assorted sausages, fruits, fresh fruit juices, bread and rice. Wow. The coach who released a statement to the media has repeatedly apologized to our staff and management for the erroneous Kikyam comment. However, the statement had already gone viral before she could make corrections. This coach admitted that she was not present during the breakfast buffet. She saw the chicken sausage in a plastic container which is not a hotel container as we do not use plastic for packed meals and assumed that this was the full breakfast offering. What? So once again, to avoid this kind of fake news, always search for the evidences or facts before we conclude that it is real. Oh no! Now it's your turn to identify which of the following images is real or make-believe. First image, the Malagasang II Elementary School held its centennial celebration last January 12, 2019. Is it real or make-believe? Correct, it is real. Next image is known as Governor Poggi. This governor rose to fame because of how creative his announcements were, especially when suspending classes. Is it real or make-believe? Correct, it's real. This image is about the legend of a seahorse. Is it real or make-believe? Correct, it's make-believe. Next image features the Filipino culture belief in the powers of an agimat or amulet. Is it real or make-believe? Correct, it's make-believe. And for the last image, Imus is the flag capital of the Philippines. Is it real or make-believe? Very good, it's real. So once again, here are the answers for our first activity.
Let us now proceed to our next activity. In here, you are going to read each sentence and decide if it is a fact or non-fact. Write your answer on a piece of paper. Number 1. My sister stayed up several nights to watch the Korean series Crash Landing on You. Is it a fact or non-fact? Number 2. The papers on the desk jump from one person to another. Is it a fact or non-fact? Number 3. The president had meetings with the officers. Is it a fact or non-fact? Number 4. There was no one at home, so my pet cat cooked for us. Is it a fact or non-fact? And last number 5. I found 100 pesos on the street. Is it a fact or non-fact? So now, let us check your work if your answers are correct. That ends our discussion today about real or fact and make-believe or non-fact. So that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and please do not forget to like and share this video and subscribe on my channel. So see you again. Bye-bye.